I always just think of Miami Art School as the best of the best. So Miami Art School is, is at the intersection of real world and education. Our students work on live plant briefs as, as well as some award briefs at the same time. Students learn by doing and following and shadowing all the creative directors in an agency. Advertising is not like going to school for engineering. You get the rigor and the academic nature of a scientific program, but you also get the fun and the, the touchy feeliness of an art program. And that's why I think it excels so well. We are not a typical school at all. We don't have tests, we don't have textbooks, we don't have lectures. We only work with students on creating their portfolios. From day one to day end, they're only working on live briefs. All of our professors or instructors are actual practicing professionals, uh, so they haven't spent a day off the field, so to speak. And there was a huge difference in their knowledge of the industry because they're still keeping up with the pace because they're in the client offices, they need to speak to everything that's coming about, and they're quick on their feet. Miami High School in Germany, I worked on a lot of German clients, so it was um, some Adidas, which was probably the coolest. I'm working on Adidas now again, which is nice, so I know the brand a little bit. What was good about that is that it came right from the actual agency and they've been working on it so it's always nice when the creative director comes in and he's given this brief to his teams and stuff at his work and comes and gives you the exact same brief as a student. Here in Toronto there are so many places and so many things we can do um, where we can really get into subcultures, get into societies, get into the neighborhoods of the city and use the city as our lab. A market that's so developed in advertising like Toronto or like Canada um, to, to have this gold standard program being dropped in, it's going to be, I think, relatively game-changing.